Go near the California Oregon border. Tribal, state, and federal leaders all applauding a plan to remove four dams along the Klamath River. KTVU's Brooks Droz joins us now from the newsroom with a closer look at what's being called the largest river restoration project in American history. Brooks. Well, Mike, this is a major step forward in restoring the Klamath River. It's a watershed that tribal communities have long relied on, but drought and wildfires have destroyed ecosystems and fish habitats. Now there are new efforts and new money to improve the health of the river for generations. Nearly two decades of debate over four Klamath River dams have reached a literal breaking point. Finally, we can say with certainty that these dams, these dams are coming down and it's about dam time. It will be the largest dam demolition in U.S. history near the California-Oregon line, opening up hundreds of miles of salmon habitat, a fish and a river that holds cultural significance to Klamath tribes. Our prayers have been answered. And a path found. Utility Pacificor used the dams to generate power, but says this plan balances a desire for dam removal with protections for electricity customers. It comes following years of drought and devastating wildfires, polluting the water, decreasing water supplies, and causing fish die-offs. My dream is to not only bring the salmon back, but bring back a, a, a way of life, bring back to restore that uh, that culture. Tribal leaders joined with state and federal officials to celebrate collaboration. Oregon, California, two governors, congressmen, tribal leaders answered the bell and paved the way. This is how things get done. Commitment, not passing interest to be here not just today, but in 2023 in those first first dam comes down and here in 2024 when all the dams are gone and for the many decades it will take for the restoration to fully take shape. $5.8 million in new federal money is in play for tribal water projects to help restore aquatic ecosystems and habitats. The entire restoration project considered urgent and necessary action to keep the river freely flowing and fish growing. We are committed to protecting this special place for decades to come so that future generations will know the same abundance and beauty of the Klamath River Basin as all of your ancestors did. The Federal Energy Regulatory Commission approved the dam demolition plan last month. The first dam could be removed as early as next summer. Brooks DeRose, KTVU, Fox 2 News. All right, Brooks, thank you for that.